Hey, good facts here. Today we're at a review of Xavier Rhodes closed in month 17. He does have tip drill, which is awesome. I'm comparing him to Deion Sanders here. Very similar speed. The acceleration and agility a little bit lower than Deion, which kind of does hurt the card, but he does have 99 press. So man press system. It's better to pair him with like Aqib Talib for that kind of stuff. Uh, but neither one of them are great against the run, although I will say Xavier Rhodes is uh, you will see some big hits from him because he has that 80 threshold of hit power i think which is like a b tier hit power a would be 90 and plus uh, but the, the agility acceleration i do think makes him better than to leave his obvious counterpart um he's going for slightly bit more than to leave too but uh play rec at 88 it's a little bit low catching also 77 is low so say like Deion sanders is going to make a lot more plays for you but Deion sanders is a little bit more expensive than uh Rhodes and to leave both at about 360 or so uh, moving on down, the block shedding is is uh, 68 on the card, which is not great. You're going to see him struggle against the run, but uh, Pursuit 85, you're going to see a little issue there. And uh, man coverage, zone coverage, like I said, 99. But uh, zones play as they play, pretty shitty. But uh, moving on for the rest of the card, pretty solid looking card. Great stuff on this. Uh, the Blockbuster promo gave us a lot of cards with 99 speed. So basically, you need a 99 speed corner if you're going to keep up. But of course, the Del Rio helps a lot of corners get to that 99 speed. There's a little bit nice little block shed. Uh, but So that's why I don't think this uh, Rhodes card is as necessary as it would have been if uh, Del Rio didn't exist. Like So if only a couple cards get to 99 speed, then it's, uh, it is whatever. There's Rhodes trying to make a play, but uh, gets beaten man coverage. That's, uh, that happens once in a while. Sometimes the road is open and does not close. Once again, 99 man coverage, 99 speed, getting beat like that. So there's certain man coverages work, certain routes beat man coverage, whatnot, and no, still, nice completion. Beat man coverage, 99 speed, and Sean Taylor just decided not to. There's the pursuit. You see that? You see that bad pursuit angle? Uh, Rhodes will take bad pursuit angles because of the low pursuit, but still, I do enjoy this card quite a bit. I do think he is the pickup over Tlaib. I believe I said that already. What more do you want from me? The tip drill alone, if you put together a tip drill secondary, you are going to get a lot more picks that way. You won't be uh, dropping those opportunities that you would have with other, say, cards like, like Tlaib's trash chem of uh, pick six. But uh, more so, we've seen Rhodes, I've seen him get beat deep, weirdly enough. Like, watch this play right here. What is this? How did he get beat? I mean, it's not like his acceleration's that terrible at 95. That just that just absolutely confused me. And there, um, nice knockdown. So overall, I, I do love Talib, and he's going. He's like a high-end card, but he's not going for my. There again, Madden playing like Madden. I don't know why he didn't go for that ball. So hopefully, in 18, that's a little bit fixed up. Uh, but that is uh, just how we play the ball in 17. Can't wait for 18 in a month away. Nice little knockdown. I guess I could probably go on for the pick there, but. When I go deep for picks and I hit that Y button, it's like it forces an interaction there between the Y receiver and the cornerback, and generally the cornerback's going to lose that deep route there. Not nah, that's got to be a play he makes. But I mean, I, I guess I mean the offense has very skilled players too, so not everything. Here it is, boom! Look at Roadstone hit sticks. Talib can't do that. That's pretty amazing. Like I, I prefer Night Train Lane or the new Jalen Rams or some of the other ones, but there is Night Train Lane and Rhodes not able to knock the ball out. Here is watch this, watch this beautiful block shed. Not. He ends up scoring attention on that play. I cut it because uh, there are children watching this, and this is YouTube. We can't be showing terrible things like that. But uh, did like this Rhodes card, 9.5, good priced. Pushed that up to like a 9.6 with with the uh, price because he's a top end card for a decent price. Thanks for watching. Call to action. I'll see you tomorrow.